All right, so for those of you that watched the summoning video I put out yesterday with my little brother, you would have seen that your boy was finally able to pull the new Fizz Super Saiyan GT Goku. And not just one, but three of them in back to back to back multis. So if you guys missed that video, you definitely want to go back and check it out because it was absolutely insane. I'll put a link above my head for that. But uh, anyways, now that we have him, we can finally run a proper GT Heroes team, which is exactly what we're going to do in today's video. We got my uh, Super Saiyan Goku, of course, with two dupes. Unfortunately, level 1 links, but that's okay, he's still going to be a monster. And the rest of the team consists of LR Super Saiyan 4 Goku, LR Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta, Int Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, the uh, new uh, tech Go Bros from GT as well, and... I know this Gohan obviously isn't from GT, he doesn't exactly fit the theme of the team, but he's just so good for the new Goku that I couldn't resist. So let's pretend he fits here, okay? And with all that said, let's jump into the showcase. We have the Goku on the first rotation, and I think I'm actually going to move him in the middle for some more links. There we go. And he's starting off with 152,000 and 416 defense, which is very respectable, but he does also raise defense on his super attack. So uh, yeah, he's pretty tanky overall. I would say like not the most tanky unit, but definitely tanky enough for most things in this game. So we're going to start by giving a few orbs to Gohan. I think I can afford to give those and let's try to give. Oh yeah. Okay. This is... <laughs> This is about as good of a start as uh, you can ask for. We got 10 orbs. All right, now, if you guys didn't see the calculations on the Dokkan Wiki, because of the way his passive is calculated, he gets up to 56% additional attack with each orb obtained. So this should be a very good... <laughs> okay, I was... I was selling him short, man. I was selling him short. Oh my god, dude. And the additional two. I'm speechless. I'm speech. I don't know what to say. This kid just busted out two seven plus million attack stats on the first turn. On the first turn. And this is with level one links, guys. Level one links. I mean, just imagine him with... Um, I don't know, level 10 links, right? And, oh my god, that's just, that's nuts. That, that's, that's all I can say. I mean, what can you say to that? Turn one, he's doing this stuff. Like, there's so many outliers in this game that can't do that. You know, he hits harder than pretty much 95% of the outliers in the game. You know, like, obviously there are a few exceptions. But, he's up there, man he's up there I would like to see the you know, like where he ranks now as well as the Vegeta of course who I don't have so I can't use him in today's video but um, I would like to see you know where these guys rank now on that list of the hardest hitting TURs because they must be in the top 10 they must be in the top 10 could they beat Videl probably not I, I don't think they're like on Videl's level which is kind of funny to say but I don't think they are but yeah they gotta be in the top 10 for sure all right, so now we have the Gobros. Uh, as you can see, their defense does not start off very good because they are a uh, second slot unit, right? They get their attack and defense boost when performing a super attack. But um, the thing is... Actually, no, I can put Go Goku in the front. That's okay. All right, so Goku right now has 171,468 defense with the double support. And uh, let's see how many orbs we can get here. So not as many orbs it looks like, but still a decent amount. Eight orbs. And we'll just give these guys whatever. I don't want to waste too many orbs on these guys. So uh, let's give this Gohan... We'll give him six. We'll give him six. Okay, here we go. So double support this time. Two less orbs though. Let's see what the attack stat is. Still respectable, man. Still respectable. <laughs> Yo, he's not even rainbow, and he's... Oh my god, another additional. 
so for anybody keeping track, okay, between the last two turns, two appearances, um, he's he's put out what is the math? I don't even know. Uh, 15 million ish on the first turn, about 13 on this turn, so 28 million, <laughs> something like that. I don't know. I'm, I'm probably a little bit off, but this is just ludicrous, man. Like this, this should not be happening. This, this TUR should not be doing this. But you know, that's that's the power creep, I guess. Um, I shouldn't be too shocked, but I am though. I, I I really am. Like I've used him a little bit since yesterday, but I really haven't had uh, too much time to test him out fully. Like the Goku, the the Fizz Goku, and wow, just just wow. This is, I mean, it's awesome. It's awesome. But the power creep is very real. It's very, very real. Um, I know the Vegeta is capable of obviously putting up numbers like this as well. So, you know, I, I want him to. I don't know if I'm going to go back, though. Just because at this point, I've spent about a thousand stones. And I did want the, the Goku more. So I did get the one I wanted more. And I feel like all my luck is just used up, you know, like after you pull three in a row, you know, like that in back-to-back -back multis. What kind of luck would, what can you expect to still have? Oh, oh, yeah, there we go. Okay, turn five, guys. Turn five, we have the active skill. I am going to save it, though. I am going to save it because uh, I want to use it on MUI Goku. But the fact that we can get it on turn five is a good sign. Of course, it's not super common. They're not going to be getting double supers every single turn like we did. We got really lucky there. But it is possible, of course. So, that's good to see. Alright, so 171,000 defense. Um, let me see what we should do. In terms of orbs, I think we can only give him 4 at most. Yeah, okay, so I'll give him 4. That's fine. And then... Uh... Get one orb to the Go Bros, and then the friend can get five orbs. Okay, so defensively, I'm not too concerned. Uh, yeah, there you go. Double digits. And then after we super, we should be tanking even better. So yeah, as you can see, a big drop off, right? Big drop off in damage output, but that's to be expected, because we did get far less orbs than before. And the defense is holding up quite well. I love this animation too, with the... <laughs> with the Goten and Go Gohan. Even though they don't do a lot of damage, that, that's kind of unfortunate, but they do enough damage for a support unit. So, I'm not going to complain. And after two supers, they should be very tanky. 59, alright. That's funny, 5-9 is Goku. Goku, right? 5-9. Anyways, uh, I love this team, guys. This This is a really fun team. The Super Saiyan 4s um, I included just because it's the Allied Super Saiyan 4s. You could go with the, uh, different units for this team, of course. But they still hold up really well, honestly. Like for, you know, like two-year-old units at this point, I think their damage is still good enough. Um, of course, one issue is that they need to perform their supers. Uh, Vegeta also needs an Ultra Super to actually do good damage. Or, sorry, not damage. Uh, good tanking to get good defense. So, I'm a little bit worried right now. I'm thinking about popping an item. But I kind of don't want to. Uh, we just got supered. What are the chances? What are the chances we're going to get supered again in the first slot? Probably not super high, right? <laughs> We're gonna die, aren't we? I, after I, as soon as I said that, I was like, "That was a mistake. I shouldn't have said that." Because we're gonna get supered now. Okay, so we're taking double digits. Thankfully, we didn't get supered. All right, all right, we're good. We're good. Yeah. Um. But as I was saying, the LS Super Saiyan fours for you know units that are two years old at this point. I think um, their damage is still very good, and. The existence of now the GT heroes category, the Goku and the Vegeta, I think make them even better, right? So it's kind of like revitalized them a little bit because before, like you know, you couldn't really run them on. I mean, you, you had Shadow Dragon Saga, which had a 150% lead at best, 
And then there was Pure Saiyans, 150% lead. Oh, this is gonna suck. This is gonna suck. He's actually the worst person to get super. Ooh. Okay, that hurt a bit. That hurt a bit. Not not terribly, but just just a little bit. All right, so we're gonna give him seven orbs. We have 171,000 defense still, and it should hold up. It should definitely hold up. And that should do it for Super Saiyan God Goku. Now we got three more stages: Super Saiyan Blue Goku, um, STR UI Goku, which really scares me because of how many phase units we have. And then MUI Goku should be a breeze. Okay, MUI Goku. Unless, unless he dodges all of our Fizz Goku attacks, it should be pretty chill. Because, you know, our Fizz Gokus are just going to be hitting so hard. Alright, let me see what we do here. Uh, okay, we're going to give a 24 key super to Goku. That's going to be at least an 18 key. Alright. And... Let me see. We should be fine, honestly. I mean, am I a little bit concerned? About Vegeta, yes, but I think he will hold up nicely. Should be okay. All right, so uh, guys, for the most part, you guys have seen what this team is capable of. I'm super impressed, definitely. Oh, we got the counter too. I was waiting for that. I was waiting for the counter. We got three units that can counter supers, which is always fun. And yeah, even though the GT Heroes team is kind of limited, it's nice that Goku and Vegeta both have sub leads, right? Goku with the Goku's family, Vegeta with the Vegeta's family. So, you know, when it comes to team building, they're, they're both, I would say, pretty versatile units for team building purposes. I think we actually might kill Goku here. This should do it. Oh, never mind. Never mind. That's okay. It's all good. All right. Um... Hmm, that's eight orbs. All right, let's give eight orbs to Goku. Gogeta's fine with uh, just one. Although I want to heal up a little bit, so let's give him four into orbs for that healing. And we'll give a nice amount of orbs to Gohan as well, just in case we need him to, you know, take that hit at the end. All right, 6.44 million is his attack stat. No real surprises there, I would say. And 4.25 mil. I mean, it's crazy that I'm saying, yo, this man's getting over 6 million attack stats. It's not a surprise. I mean, it should be a surprise. It should be a surprise. But just given, like, how this guy's performed over the last X amount of turns, 10 plus turns, I'm, I'm not surprised now. Like, that's what I expect. But you shouldn't expect that from a... Uh, I don't confess to you are like it's just it feels kind of wrong <laughs> but I'm not complaining I'm definitely not complaining all right so we got some active skills here just because this Goku does scare me um, way more than the NTUI Goku for sure so let's see um, yeah, that's fine. Okay, I'll give these to Goku. That's still an 18 key. We can get that 24 key super with Vegeta. And then, ooh, Dokkan attack too. Okay, this, ooh, this might finish off UI Goku. Let's see. Gotta get this perfect, of course. Let's go. One, two, oh, three, four, five, six. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. This might be the first time in like four or five showcases. That I got that token attack perfect. Because I, I don't know why. Recently I've just been missing a lot. But not this time. If this crits, I'm going to say he's dead. Ooh, no crit. Additional. He's dead either way. Alright. See, this is what I was saying, man. The LR Super Saiyan 4s are still monsters. And they're even better now. With uh, you know these new supports, the new side units, the Trunks and Gohan, or, or Trunks and Goten, and then the uh, Gohan and Goten, and of course the new leads. All right, so now this should be a breeze. Um, th th this stage should very much be a breeze. Uh, defensively, everybody's looking okay. I'm slightly concerned about Gogeta, but you know he can still counter. So hmm. Yeah, I'll leave him in the middle. Let's give seven orbs to my Goku. Oh, I 
should have used the active skill. Hopefully we get one more chance. Hopefully we get one more chance, because that would be sad if I had the chance to use the active skill and it didn't. Alright, 10 orbs for the friend. 10 orbs for the friend. Okay, so we're taking 10 damage, 103, over 5 mil for my Goku. Should be over 6 mil for the friend, because I believe it's also 79%. And... 2.4. Alright, All right, that's, that's decent, that's decent. We're getting supered, I'm gonna say less than 50k. If it's more than 50, I'll be surprised. Oh, okay, I am surprised. 70, 75k, 75k. Obviously, it could have been a lot worse. We've seen how much you know damage UI Goku can do to lesser defensive units, right? We've seen him do like 500k to some people, so that's that's totally fine. And then the friend here, 7.1. Oh god, of course. Oh, additional, please don't dodge this one. Don't dodge this one, come on, thank you. Thank you. All right. At least one landed. At least one landed. And that's a 5.6 mil crit. Okay, so I gotta, I gotta kind of try hard to not, uh, I gotta try hard to not let these guys kill UI Goku because I need to pop that active skill next turn. I gotta have at least one more turn. So, okay, so just to be safe, I'm gonna pop him for the snake, just in case we get supered before Goku has a chance to uh, super himself. And then let's just go for 12 key supers here. Uh, you know what, I'm gonna let Vegeta have a 24 key. Just cause he doesn't get his defense unless he does. And then we'll give him two orbs to Gohan. Okay. Well, this is about to do it guys. I hope you enjoyed the showcase. Uh, I certainly enjoyed making it cause this team is just so, too, so damn fun. Um, especially the new Goku, man. Just the numbers he's putting out is blowing my mind. It really is. He's he's out of control. So uh, yeah, I'm glad I got him. Shout out to my little brother Phoenix for for getting. Oh oh, should be okay for uh, you know helping with the assist. Because without him, wouldn't have happened. I can guarantee you, if I was doing that video by myself, we would have pulled no Goku's. So all credit goes to him. And if you guys saw that video, I did promise him I would buy him a car in the future. So, <laughs> guess I gotta start saving up now. And, alright, now let's pop this active skill. Hope you guys are ready. Uh, let me put it in the middle. I think he might get one more link in the middle. Yes, he does. Okay, so let's get it. Oh, that is so clean. That is so clean. Nice. All right. So with that done, uh, eight orbs. If it lands, should finish him. If not, Gogeta will do the trick. And if Gogeta doesn't do the trick, I'm a little bit concerned about the Gobros at the end. Oh, we're good. We're good. All right. So, you know Goku is dead. That's going to be the... Oh. He survived it. All right, Gogeta. Okay, that's gonna do it. Okay, well, <laughs> little scary moment. I was like, if he supers the Gobros, could be bad news, but we got it done. Took one more attack than expected. And that's gonna be it, guys. That is today's showcase of the GT Heroes team. It is incredible, man. It is absolutely ridiculous. I love it. And uh, I'll definitely be running it a lot more. We did not take 29 minutes. Well, I think I left to do something before I started the video. But yeah, there you go, guys. That is the showcase. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about the new Goku, the new Vegeta, if you guys have, you know, tested him as well or seen him. And uh, hopefully you guys did well in your summons. Hopefully you guys got, you know, at least one of each. And uh, if you want to flex some summons if, or if you want to cry about some despair, uh, whatever it may be, definitely leave it in the comments down below. <laughs> and that's it. That's the video. Thank you for watching. As always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. If it's your first time, if you're new, then smash that subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. Hit that notification bell to let YouTube know you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time, hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media.
signing out.